<laughs> what is up everybody? My name is Prophet and today I want to talk about cunts. You know, cunts are everywhere. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I have my mic moved in a whole nother position because um, last time the cable came undone because it was too tight. So I have it in a completely new position. I don't know how well the wind is going to be held up. It's actually like right in front of my face now. Um, but it should be good because it has a lot of uh, extra fuzzy shit on it. Oh, oh fuck, fuck yeah, cunt. Holy shit traffic. So yeah, I'm, uh, I'm headed to school and um, there's one thing I want to talk to you guys about. Pit bulls are so vicious, man. Yeah, pit bulls are so vicious, man. Oh my god. If you can't tell by my voice, I'm being extremely sarcastic. So, the rescue center where I went to pick up my dog, for those of you that don't know, I have a new puppy. He's an Australian Shepherd, and um, it was a dog rescue center, so of course they had other things. Um, so when I get there, there's this dog chilling behind this desk, and I have no idea who this dog is. Like, I don't know what's going on. I hear a dog barking behind the desk. I'm like, what the fuck? And then uh, I finally look over and it's a pit bull and she only has like a little bit of her like fur left. Like, it's just mostly, she's mostly made of skin. Her ear is completely burnt off. And so basically I asked them, I'm like, hey, who's this puppy or dog? And they were like, oh, you didn't know? She was in the news and everything, blah, blah, blah. She is, she's one of our sponsor dogs. The owner tied her up and burnt her and his house for fun. Like some sick fuck. Literally for fun, guys. Like he, he burnt this dog because he enjoyed doing it. I don't understand what's wrong with people. I mean, I, I just, I really don't get it. Yeah, anyway, so everyone's first assumption when they meet a pit bull is they are going to be vicious. Especially if they were, you know, raised in the situation that this dog was, you know, grown up in. And, and so everyone's just like, you know, everyone assumes automatically when they meet a pit bull, especially one that's been, you know, in a hostile environment like that when it was a puppy and grown up in those kind of situations. And uh, guess what? It was the nicest dog I have ever met. And I'm not even gonna lie, man. I mean, I, I hear so much media bullshit about pit bulls and so much just, you know, absolute bullshit about these dogs. And in reality, it's the owner. I mean, in this case, even the owner was a dickhead to the dog. And guess what? The dog was still full of nothing but love. The dog was a sweetheart. I mean, poor thing, like, who does that to animals? I just don't get it. I fucking hate this road, because everyone goddamn turns. And I have to do that shit. And so another thing I've realized about this helmet is that no matter what I do to the mic, no matter where I place it, the wind noise is absolutely everywhere, and I can't do it damn thing about it. I can only try and make it as best as possible and hopefully I have achieved that. Just want to have some fun in the morning. I think I'm late to school. I got no idea. No, I'm not. <laughs> I know there's no cops on that first stretch of road, which is why I had to slow down after that. Yeah, anyway, most people, as soon as they deal with pit bulls or think about a pit bull, they think a vicious, mean dog, and he's gonna hurt me. Ah! 
No, man, it's all about the owner, and like I said, even in this case, it wasn't even the owner. So yeah, guys, if you're one of those people that uh, hear Pitbull or think Pitbull and you automatically assume, you know, dangerous dog, it's gonna bite my face off and kill me, then, you know, you guys should rethink. Actually go meet a Pitbull, go, go, go have a conversation with him, be like, hey, what's up, buddy, how you doing? And he'll be like, ah, oh, nothing, man, I'm just a Pitbull, just chilling and shit. But no, I mean, I'm serious. You know, if, if your first assumption when you think of a pit bull is bad dog, vicious, mean, that's gonna bite your face off, then you should interact with someone that has a pit bull or an actual pit bull and you will change your mind, I guarantee it. I mean, of course, they're not all nice. I mean, that's, that's, that's with any dog. It's not just a pit bull. I'm just saying, guys, keep an open mind because there's nothing wrong with pit bulls. It's, it's all dogs in general. They can all be that way. Fuck yeah, cunt! Oh, he heard me. <laughs> I hate people that do this sometimes. The speed limit's like 35, so they're like, oh, I'm gonna go 30. Me, I always go five over, but if I'm, my, I'm on my bike, I'll go 10 over, but most of the time, I'll go five over if I'm in my car. Whatever the speed limit is, plus five, and, or more most of the time. <laughs> if there's any cops watching this, no, I always do the speed limit. I'm sorry, officer. <laughs> What time is it? Okay, I'm not late. Alright, alright. So yeah guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, there are many more to come. If you guys want to request a topic, leave it in a comment. Do whatever you need to do. And uh, I will make sure I get that done. So thank you guys so much for watching and have a real nice day.